Hey guys, today I'm going to share a fantastic secret with you. See, if you've ever tasted my turkey, my grilled chicken, and you've asked me, Nancy, what is this I'm tasting? What is this special taste? Well, today I'm going to tell you everything I use. This is my secret herb blend that I use for pretty much every single protein, and it takes it to 100. I'm telling you, what you're going to need, simple things around us. You need some thyme, some basil, and some parsley now these three are important you can actually do the dry versions but make sure the basil is fresh okay green bell peppers lemons carrots garlic spring onions rosemary you need some sesame oil and peanut oil you guys those two oils are very important for this marinade now we're going to make it comfy with our carrots and our peanut and sesame oil you want to cook this on low heat you can use a tiny pot. I'm not really going heavy on the garlic because I always have ginger and garlic paste, okay? So this is just for some sweetness, the carrots, and then the garlic for some flavor. Once the garlic, you know, is tender, check with a spoon. It should be about 10 minutes on heat. You could turn it, the heat off and then just allow it to cool in the fridge or something. You cannot blend hot <laughs> oils with your greens because it will just change the color and it will cook them all right so make sure you cool the oil now place all your herbs in the blender everything you don't need to take out the the stem or the stalk or whatever it is <laughs> i don't know what it's called but yeah put everything the way it is make sure they're washed properly add your bell peppers these cannot be substituted but you can substitute your spring onions um, with some onions if you don't have access to spring onions you could also do the dry rosemary some dry thyme if you don't have access to fresh the herbs are from my garden but i bought some thyme and rosemary now you want to make sure you add some lemons these are for the acidity that you need to cut through the protein when you're marinating and it just allows the seasoning to penetrate okay now this is our cooled down comfy you want to add that as well you don't need to add any single water guys this will blend easily your blender is fantastic like mine so just blend that and what you're going to be left with is this beautiful vibrant green paste and you're going to apportion all those uh all that into the silicone molds i'm using my mini muffin molds if you don't have one you could use your ice cube molds just make sure they're silicone molds so they're easy to just pop them out when they are frozen all right if you use the plastic molds it might be hard you may need to run it through water before you can get them out you know once they are frozen but yeah shake them freeze them and what you're going to be left with is this amazing amazing marinade that you can use for pretty much your turkey your chicken everything that you want to cook yeah, sometimes I even use it for beef if I'm making maybe beef fried rice, but this takes everything to 100. Freeze them in your silicone bags or your Ziploc bags and thank me later. Okay, make sure you try it and God bless you all. Mwah.